on one hand, you know, like you already awakened Pete, I, I didn't get it, but uh, about we are the earth. About, we, sorry? That we are, this must not be very well placed, that we, uh, that we are the earth. Hmm. Hmm. His enlightenment and that the earth itself is a testament to his awakening. And then on the other hand, that there's this language, and I imagine that language is what's tripping me up more than anything else. Mm. But maybe you could uh, help steer me with some better language. That uh, in a lot of Buddhist uh, writings, you know, from Dogen, dropping away body and mind, or in the Vajrayana tradition of Rigpa, which is seen as something you know beyond body and mind. That uh, how, how do you how do you pl- how do you work with those dimensions? Like, can you can you bring those together for me? That uh, how, in, how in one sense is the Buddhist path dropping away body and mind and at the very same time being part of the earth? Well, to, to continue that story, right? Uh, bo- I, should, I should always keep Dogen. on reading. I just kept on reading. I would have saved, uh, would have saved you the trouble. <laughs> maybe, maybe. Because after Dogen had his experience, he went to see his teacher and, and he, you know, he talked about, you know, body and mind have dropped away. So what's after that? Mm. It is dropped away body and mind. <laughs> it, it's, a it different way, it's a different way of experiencing your body, and it's a different way of experiencing your mind, if you want to divide it up into those bits, yeah. right? So it's not about transcending, and, and this is where religions, including some types of Buddhism, get trapped, right? It's about transcending, going somewhere else, some other dimension, some other reality. No, it's about a transformed way of, of experiencing your sense of self, a transformed way of experiencing your body and the transformed way of relating to other people and, and to the earth. And the main point of that transformation is overcoming the sense of separation because that that's, that's, seems to be really at, at the heart of the problem. And, and, and that's not to say that you aren't you and I am I. I mean, there's that dimension too. But nonetheless, what it means for you to be you and what it means for me to be me, there, there's a kind of interdependence and interconnection and, and relationship. So, you know, there's, there's the two sides to it.